Okay, what we're going to do is start looking at the structure now of our document. So as you know, most websites are split into different sections. So what we're going to do is split our one into sections as well. So we're going to do this by using divs. So a div, as you may not short, is for is short for sorry, uh, division. So we're going to by section, another name for section is a division. So we're going to do div and we're going to give this. Remember, we did classes previously. So we're going to give this a name div equal class equals um, what we're going to do is going to make a class up, we're going to call it top and then we're going to close that div off and then as you know all open divs followed by closed div so that's the first div we made okay once you create a div what you need to do is press the tab button and indent that div okay once you uh, the next uh, div we're going to make so div actually I'm going to make life quicker by copy and pasting this so I'm just going to copy that Paste that one there. Okay, make sure you properly indent it. Okay, paste, one, two, paste. One, two, three. So we're gonna have one called top, one called nav, that's for the navigation, one called banner, followed by, we're gonna call, I'm just gonna call it section one, I'm gonna call this one gallery, and one more, I think I'm gonna add one more in there. And I'm gonna call that footer. Okay, so now I've sectioned off. I'm sorry, sectioned off my page. So in this section, I'm gonna have the top header. In this section, I'm gonna have the navigation bar. It's gonna be a banner in this section. In this section, I'm gonna have um, just text, gallery over here, and then finally, in the footer section, I'm gonna have footer. So. That's my uh, page sectioned off. So what I need to do now is, firstly, if I was to run that, so view this, refresh my page, I will not see anything there. Okay, um, if I put some content in here, so I'm just gonna write content, and paste that multiple times in each of the sections. Okay, if I refresh my screen, they're all underneath each other. Now, you still can't tell whether this div has worked or not, or if, these, if this page is sectioned off. So what we need to do is add styles to each of those uh, divs. So firstly, we need to do top dot, sorry, dot top. Remember, it's a custom style. If it was, um, because it's a class, we do a dot. Um, if it's a tag within HTML, we don't put a dot in front of it. So we're gonna put a dot, and then we're going to say background color. I'm going to make that blue. Or uh, oh, actually, let me just pick a light color. Just do this pinkish here. No, that's, uh, okay. Let's do that color for that. And then I'm going to close that off. Okay. Now I'm going to copy the, copy this. As many times as I need it. So one, two, three, four. Okay, I'm just going to replace the name top with nav banner. Was this the next one? Banner section one gallery and footer. Okay, we're going to change the colors as well. So to differentiate between the two. So I'm gonna do that black pink. So let's do this blue. Blue and blue. Now if we were to do that, okay, can you see that's now sectioned off? Now the second one is not sectioned off because we did hashtag blue. Okay, should just be blue on its own. Okay, so now as you can see the div, so the page is now split into six different sections. Okay, so uh, well, and what we notice at the top as well here, that uh, and on the sides, that there's a little gap. So to remove that gap, what we need to do is go into body. Uh, what we do is margin and then equals zero. Okay, so now that's firmly across the top. Okay, so that's your page split into separate divisions. 
and split up. 